So, Starlink is finally here. Well, almost. All indications are showing that we might still get Starlink in Q3 of 2024 as earlier announced. Fingers crossed, a handful of African countries have already started using Starlink and just recently Ghana and Botswana are the latest countries to get Starlink. Now what makes the Botswana situation unique is that they announced after Zimbabwe that they had licensed Starlink and now they have Starlink in their country. Unfortunately for us, Potras does not have the best track record in informing its citizens. But a lot has since taken place since I last posted a Starlink update. For starters, IMC Communications, not sure if they still have exclusive rights since Potras announced that no company has exclusive rights to distributing Starlink. Using Starlink on Rome is now harder since Starlink announced a 60-day limit and Starlink users will need to pay an additional $200 to enable roaming. And reports are showing that some Starlink users in South Africa and Cameroon have had their service cut off. If anything, this is showing that there's a very high demand for high-speed internet in Africa. Now, a little birdie told me that we might be getting Starlink soon. And this was confirmed by Willard Soko, a Zimbabwean techie who's been following Starlink events closely. Shout out to him. He shared a document on X showing that Starlink had provisioned IP addresses for Zimbabwe. Now, for those who don't know what provisioning is, it's just the first step in setting up the ground to offer networking services in the country, basically. And guess which other country was on the list? Botswana. And they have announced that Starlink has started operating in the country. So far in Botswana, the cost of hardware is going for 4,820 Pula, which is equivalent to $359. And the subscriptions are going for 688 Pula, which is 51 US dollars. So far, Botswana has the highest prices for Starlink in the region, and I'm expecting that Zimbabwe will probably offer similar pricing. Now, since no announcement has been made in regards to IMC communications, I think it's wise to be on the waiting list. You can go to the Starlink website to do that. You will need a $9 deposit. Many sources have indicated that Starlink is due to launch on the 1st of September 2024. Personally, I wouldn't know much about the exact date, but what I know is just the launch of Starlink is just days away. Now, Starlink coming to Zimbabwe is not going to be an easy ride though because local players have decided to pull up their socks. Econet has just launched their SmartBees internet, starting at $45 for 5 megabits. Although in reality, users have been getting more. And it's proving popular with Zimbabweans. I'm currently testing out this service. Full review in a day or two. At the end of the day, the biggest winner is the Zimbabwean customer. I'll keep you updated on more Starlink news. So make sure that you're subscribed to the channel. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video.